This video demonstrates FiberMesh, a system for modeling freeform surfaces by sketching and manipulating 3D curves. Our system utilizes 3D curves as a means to define and modify shapes. Users can create freeform surfaces by sketching and manipulating curves. This interface concept is effective and intuitive for artists and novice users since it transfers the skill of 2D drawing into 3D modeling. Let us demonstrate the basic components of fiber mesh. The creation of a new shape begins by sketching a silhouette. Our system meshes the interior of the silhouette curve and computes the initial surface. Any curve sketched by the user stays on the surface and may serve as a manipulation handle. The curve can be dragged and bent. Its deformation is designed to be detail preserving. We implemented a peeling interface that automatically decides on the size of the edited region. The further the curve is pulled, the larger the edited region becomes. Curves can be added or erased at any time. Here we add another curve by sketching on the surface. The curve is embedded in the mesh and can be manipulated to modify the shape of the surface. We can add an encircling curve by sketching a cut across the shape and clicking. Note that sketched curves become connected to existing curves at the intersection points. During the editing process, curves may become jaggy. We have added a rubbing mode in which users indicate curve regions that need smoothing. The surface is updated once the user releases the mouse button. The surface can be cut or extruded with our sketching interface. To cut a part, a curve is sketched across and the cutting operation is gestured. The resulting curve is initially marked as sharp, indicated by the red color. To perform an extrusion, a closed curve is sketched on the surface and then the extrusion silhouette is sketched in a different view. The base of the extrusion is initially marked as a sharp curve and the silhouette as a smooth curve. Users can remove a curve or any part of it by switching to the eraser tool. The surface is optimized after this operation. The genus of the surface can be increased by adding tunnels. Users can sketch two closed curves on opposite sides of the shape and the system generates a tunnel while keeping the sketched curves on the surface. The type of any part of a curve can be toggled between sharp and smooth by applying the type change tool. Here we change part of the nose curve from sharp to smooth. Here we show an example modeling session from beginning to end. We took excerpts from a three minute session due to video length limitations. As you can see, the user can create interesting 3D models by using 3D curves as flexible manipulators. In the paper, we introduce a detail-preserving curve deformation algorithm and a fast surface optimization method that make this interaction possible. Note also that the surface is defined by the curves only, since the surface geometry is computed on the fly by functional optimization. This makes our data structure very compact. We only need to store curve geometry and mesh topology. We have demonstrated that the small yet powerful toolset of fiber mesh greatly simplifies the creation and editing of diverse 3D shapes.